introduce you to one of my all-time favorites, mm -hmm. which happens to be our last 30 years of our Indian head scents. Now, these are Indian head scents that date back to 1880 to 1909. They are offered to you on four flexible payments of $49.99. And we featured these in last week's show. <laughs> and if I recall correctly, they were hands down one of the most popular choices they always are. We already sold five. <laughs> I only have 200. We normally have three to 500. Oh, yeah. They're all, this is. So the Indian head scent is by far and away, I think, the most collectible scent or so. penny. I it's, think so. It's so uniquely American. I mean, look at it. It is it is so simplistic. You've got this fantastic, uh, uh, you know, Indian head design. I'll just pull any of these out. It doesn't matter. Uh, you have this fantastic Indian head design. Look at that. 1897, one cent. And that's what you've got is every single one of the last 30 years of Indian head scents from 1880 to 1909. Now this is where it gets exciting and this is why it sells out so fast. I oftentimes sell the last 10 years. I sometimes sell the last 20 years. What I can rarely sell is the last 30 years and it's particularly the 18, uh, 1885s, 1884s, 1894s are both very, all very, very difficult coins. So do the math here. So you get 30 Indian head scents. Basically by the time you put in the cost of packaging you're looking at six dollars per coin. You're looking at six dollars per coin is what we're charging. I went into, like I said, if, if purchased individually in, in our big nationally advertised catalog, like I said, and people say, what catalog? I go, well, let's put it this way. When I was a paper boy and I was 12 years old and I was buying coins, I bought from these guys. That's how long they've been around, okay? Uh, and, and if you look at this and buy them individually, the single lowest price they have is $8.25. That's the lowest price they have for any coin. Remember, we're six bucks. So just that alone is a $60 savings. However, there are so many of these coins that are more than that. The 1909 down here is $31.50 by itself. And people are saying, why is the last one so expensive? Because in 1909, and if you remember, that's when they started the Lincoln cent. The vast majority of the capacity of the U.S. government went into making the Lincoln cent in 1909. That coin's about $8 or $10 or $12. But the Indian head cent is extraordinarily difficult to find, so that's a $31.50 coin. You're going to go there. And then you go back to the very beginning, 1880. And these are the individual, these were purchased individually. $18, $21, $16.25, $14.50, $18, $35. dollars they do not even price that one. $11.95, $11.95. You keep going down. 1894, they don't price. So what you're looking at, if you add up all of theirs, last time I think they had the 94, it was about $37.50. So we're looking at probably, I don't know, three, four hundred dollars if they had every single coin. Adding it up, it's $360 with the missing coins. They have two coins that they don't even include in there and they add up coin by coin to purchase them individually $360.25. We're $199. The best part of it is you get them all with one call. Which is why you want to order. Right. Because to get the last 30 years would be mm -hmm. almost impossible. Right. So you're going to use Mike's experience his connections in the coin business to be able to cultivate this entire collection for you. And if you'd like to order, definitely take advantage of it. You were saying to me that when you were a little boy, these were some of the coins that you got most excited about. Well, I'd take time. my paper boy money and I'd go down and I'd buy $30 worth of pennies at the bank and go through them and hope to find one or two Indian head cents. Now I can tell you right now, I wasn't finding any 1885s. Oh no. I'd find uh, 1903s, 1904s, 1905s. This is the key coin in the collection, folks, period. That is the same single hardest coin for us to put together. This is the limiting factor in the number of these sets that we sell is this 1885. This is the one that is so substantially, substantively, and crazily difficult to get. Uh, it is the rarest of the bunch. It's the most expensive of the bunch. Like I said, in the catalog, this one's $35 is what they charge for this. Remember, we're $6 a coin. Yes. There are at least four coins in here that you can individually spend $30 or more on. Now, you explained to us why the 1909 coin was so expensive. 1885, they just didn't make a lot of coins. So gotcha. what it means, it's just hard.
harder to get when they don't make as many coins. And that's what this is uh, that you're going to have right here. But that's expensive, $35. And, right, and keep in mind that every single one of these comes in their own individual airtight holders. That's a 59 cent value. You get 30 of those, so that's 18 bucks. In the box, that's $30 worth of, of packaging. And here's the thing I always tell everybody, that you know, and they're kind of trying to wrap your head around all these coins. And we're down to about under 200 now is what we're doing. If you were at, let's say you went to a garage sale and you saw this laying there and someone had a $6 price tag on it, you know you'd pick it up and take it right to the front. You know you would. It's an absolute guarantee. But it's going to be not the 1885 or the 1894 or the 1909. It's going to be one of these down here that are $8 and a quarter. So still at $6, it's a, it's a spectacular deal. But to get $30 coins and $35 coins and $37 coins for the $6 price is truly what the amazing part of this is and truly what your opportunity is. The problem with this is my uh, is the limited quantity. As you can see, 194, 193, these are what happen when I start doing this. They start counting down yeah. so incredibly quickly and they're so difficult uh, uh, for me to uh, put together because of course, you know, they, they stopped making them in 1885 and 1884. These are not reprints. They're not cleaned up. These are original coins in original condition, American Indian head cents from 1880 through 1909, the last 40 years. I love that they're encapsulated for us mm -hmm. already. I think that's a big benefit and value to you. Mm -hmm. And when I look at this, you know, think about a puzzle and only having, if it's a puzzle that takes 10 pieces, mm -hmm. but you only have three or seven, you can't complete the puzzle. So you might be able to find some of the ones at the bottom, but don't you want to have all the pieces to the puzzle? And that's what Mike has done for us. You've got them all here. If you'd like to have them just a little over 100 remaining, always, every presentation of this set is always very popular but if you would like to get the last 30 years I don't know if you heard Mike mention a little bit earlier he'll sometimes do the last 10 years sometimes 20 years this is an opportunity to get the last 30 years and I think what people don't realize that it sometimes takes you years depending on what you can find out there to be able to bring Particularly something with like the 1880 this. stuff and that 1885 very challenging is such an incredibly incredibly difficult uh, uh, 